region are voting on a new bond to improve public drinking water systems. The Champlain Water District represents several towns and cities in Chittenden County, including in South Burlington, and that's where we find NBC5 Sid Buley, who's breaking down what this means for the community. Sid. Zuri Sarah Beth polls opened about a half hour ago here at the Champlain Water District, where they're asking voters to approve an $8.7 million bond for fixing up water systems like the tank you see behind me. If voters approve the $8.7 million bond for the Champlain Water District, the money will go towards two projects. The first, building a new contact tank. This tank is where all of the final disinfection occurs for water before it gets shipped out to you at home. This one here is about 30 years old and it's been failing and leaking and so we're looking to replace it with a new one. So that's about half of the, the 8.7 million. The new tank will look a lot like this concrete one here. The new design is expected to last between 50 and 75 years, which is important as the Champlain Water District says they process around 10 million gallons of water a day. The remaining money will go towards replacing some water lines responsible for bringing water from Lake Champlain to the treatment facility. Right now we only have one line in certain sections, so if those sections go down, no water makes it from the lake to us. Thanks to a federal earmark from Senator Bernie Sanders covering $6.96 million in federal grant money, Joe Duncan says taxpayers won't be paying for the project. Instead, the remainder of the bond would be coming from a loan. There is no rate increase associated with this given the large uh, grant that we're receiving. Duncan says the goal is to stay ahead of the curve, as numerous parts of the country have seen recent failures in infrastructure. The Champlain Water District wants to ensure that their technology is up to date and they continue being able to handle all water demands in the future. Now, Duncan said they have already received a lot of absentee ballots, but for those wishing to vote in person, polls will be open here at the Champlain Water District until 7 this evening, with local town clerks counting the votes. Live in South Burlington, Sid Buley, NBC5 News.